Hi everyone. Thanks for stopping by. My name is Crafty Jackie. And it has been a long while since I have talked to you guys. Talked with you guys. And uh, lots of reasons why my phone was not letting me record. And then I lost my phone. And that was a very upsetting thing. And I did finally get another one. And I've been having problems with my back and my breathing so uh, I'm going for a shot in my back tomorrow breathing is better and um, I thought I start, should start talking to you again <laughs> so I, I got a email even from one of my subscribers uh, Becky Hill and at first I thought it was the girl I buy paparazzi from. And I thought, why would she be missing me? Oh, she needs my money. And then it dawned on me who it was. And I thought that was so sweet of her to wonder what where I was. So anyway, that is uh, how it goes. So I'm going to start out with, uh, I'm going to tell you why. I'm trying to clean my uh, craft room. It is a pit. And uh, I thought I would start out with the big basket of uh, garbage and <laughs> trash so that I can, um, yeah. So anyway, um, I'll show you as much as I can on this here video and then I'll keep the rest for next time or something. I also got new glasses. All right. Let's start with a staple of the great, the great banquet, the uh, Dollar Tree, the great Dollar Tree. This is the Salon Selectives, the one with argan oil from Morocco. Um, I have to say, not only do these smell good, but these really, really work good. I'm using some right now from the Dollar Tree, and they are not working. I have them out at the camper, so... Depending on if I decide I just am tired of them or what, I will give you a review on them. Now you should always have one of those on hand. They're they're just they're great. And this is something I bought at the Dollar Tree and I couldn't remember what it was called. So now I'm glad I found it, so maybe I can find it in the store. It's called Slim Cafe. And it has ten grams of protein, zero sugar, and only 120 calories. This was the mocha, mocha macchiato, and I'm going to tell you what, this was deli delicious and a great thing to have as a snack or something. I'm going to keep this over here because I want to try to find it in the store. All right. I have, whoa, I have, I'll do this because it's falling. That shit's all falling. Well. This we bought at the Dollar Tree. A new peanut butter chocolate blasted shreds. I threw it away, most of it. I thought it was disgusting. It left a filmy thing on my tongue. And, uh, I mean, it's been a while since this was out, but it was, I thought, nasty. The only good thing is you can use the box for crafting, painting, whatnot. But I got enough of that. Yeah. Until I get a filter on my water, my water intake, my house will smell fine until we start running water. Like when we come home from the camper, it smells great in here. And then the minute we begin um, running water again, it smells terrible. So, I burn a lot of wax melts. Um, I bought, I used these melon ball ones. These are from Walmart. Melon ball punch. They were, smelled wonderful. They smelled like melon. Yeah, very good. These also were like in the spring, tiptoe tulips. And they smelled absolutely just like tulips. I loved them. 
Oh. These are from last year. These are the warm fireside flurries. Hope they get these again because these were really, really good too. Smelled very, um, kind of a smoky smell, almost like a campfire, but sweet. These were fresh air. They smelled good. These are all the, those were all Better Homes and Gardens. Now these are fragrance bars by Cobblestone Candle called Cupcake. I don't know where I bought these. I had these for a while. And they smell good, but I mean, they're, the throw isn't great because they're just a very, very light scent. Now sometimes I have some that I can't really stand to burn them. I try to dumb them down with other things because they're so strong. They smell good in the container, and then when you burn them, you want to throw up almost. All right. This I finished. Avon Skin So Soft, Soft and Sensual, and it was a foam, and it was wonderful. I loved it. Um, it did leave your skin very, it's oil-infused foaming body wash, and it did. It left my skin very soft. Oh, another thing, guys. Look at this. I've been on Consentix now for two months. And uh, for five weeks I had to get two injections. And then I didn't get any for about two or three weeks. And then I started on my monthly ones. Uh, once a month I have two injections. And they it works. It's been really clearing me up. The only bad thing is um, I, it kind of messes with my stomach, but... What are you going to do? All right. This is from Walmart. Green Giant Mashed Cauliflower Garlic and Herb. Now, I like these really well, but they're not mashed potatoes. You can, you know, use them in place and just say, you know, we luckily we love cauliflower, so it's not a big deal, but... I can't go and say, oh, it tastes just like mashed potatoes. It does not. I've tried doing it homemade and everything. I don't care if you put a pound of butter in it, and then if you do that, you kind of, kind of just, you know, you know, ruining the whole effect anyway. So, yeah, I don't, um, I don't think they taste like mashed potatoes. Um, I got these from, for a while there I had the subscription to uh, Imperfect Produce. And then they started kicking in the dry products, too. And this was Nat Nature's Path Organic Frosted Bunch of Blueberries Toaster Pastries. They were organic, no artificial flavors or synthetic colors. They were okay. They were not like, uh, they weren't the best. But they were okay. You know, if you're trying to clean up your act a little bit, that would be a wise choice. All right, what do we got here? This is Bath and Body Works Mad About You. And this smells so delicious. And I get so many compliments when I wear this one. I have extra, so I'm not feeling too bad. All righty, what do we got here? This is... Sorry it says in random order, but that's just why I'm coming coming to get it. This I got for Christmas for my grandsons. It's 99% mermaid shea butter hand cream. And it smelled like, uh, it says sunlit apple blossom hand cream. But I thought it smelled more like pineapple, so I don't know. But it was very good. And very moisturizing on my hands. And this, as you know, is the Dove Pink. And this one is my favorite. pretty clean. Okay. Ready to paint? Yep. All right. We found some, found some little tables. Three of them. So he's going to paint them for out at the camper. Um, this one, Dove... And the, the pink dove, I really like uh, the scent of it better. Um, the other one I use, when I use the other one, I'll still use perfume. This one I will not. 
But the other one I use perfume because it smells like soap or something, you know. I've been so thirsty, I can't stand it. Okay, I finished the Bolero Honeysuckle and Green Tea hand wash. I love these hand washes. They foam really well. They last forever because you get every drop out of them. Their thing goes all the way to the bottom and it's situated where you can get every bit out. I haven't seen any good Bolero hand wash lately, so. All right, here's some more of these. Wax melts, wild berry cheesecake. It's, it's, it smells like cheesecake, it really does. So that one was good. Cashmere cream is supposed to be kind of like the cashmere woods or whatever that's uh, Glade. It smelled really good too. And this one is Sensational, it's also from Walmart, but it's the cheaper, cheaper one. Oh, okay. Well, this little packet of Gain made me a believer. I bought it just to try it, and it gets the, it, it makes the clothes smell so good. I don't like the original Gain. I, I just can't stand the smell of that. But I, I used this one, and then I bought um, one that is lavender, and I just used my last one of that yesterday. So I'm going to have to go to Walmart and get some. But I love, I know I can get all the stuff at uh, the Dollar Tree and but by the time I throw 45 things in it to get it, I could just use one of these so I do so buy detergent from the Dollar Tree some of it I donate to the food pantry and some of it I just keep on hand in an emergency these were the Bolero face wipes the lemon verbena and mint packs don't smell I love their I just love their face wipes. I think they're excellent. They always smell good. They feel good. Um, oh, I got these when we went to um, Bob Evans one day, and they were gummy piglets. They were so good, and they were so cute. I wish I would have kept one to show you guys, but they were really good. I've had a lot of gummies. I hadn't had any gummy piglets yet. Um, this is another Bolero. French lavender and citrus. I love this one. This is a puffy. Still look like brand new, but I'd used it for a long time. This is another um, packet of things. This is luminescence. This from, yeah, this one's from Dollar Tree. This was fresh linen. Um, it smells like fresh linen. But I don't, I'm not real fond of that scent. Oh, here was my frosted coconut snowball that I got for Christmas from my grandsons. Oh, it was so good. And I cut them to get every drop out. I use a plastic spoon. That I keep in my drawer. Some more wax melts. We have our Deck the Halls and Spicy Gingerbread Luminescence. These are from the Dollar Tree. And they smelled really, really good. They smelled uh, like gingerbread. With the two of them in there together, they kind of mingle the scent. It smelled like a light gingerbread. This one was Fireside Embers by sensationals I don't know where these sensationals come from this one smelled really good too like a fire got this thing about fire when I get back to the camper I'm gonna have a nice campfire but I think it's supposed to be really hot this I got darn I don't know where I got it from somewhere but it was really really good as well it has caffeine in it, which for me, I, I could use it sometimes. And ex antioxidants and vitamins. Blue raspberry sparkling ice. It was delicious. Oh, I wish I could remember where I bought it. And, I mean, it had 
all kinds of vitamins. D, B12, niacin, vitamin A, biotin. Liked it. But I don't remember where I bought it. I'm sure it wasn't at the Dollar Tree. These I bought, I had a craving for licorice when I was on our mission trip. So I bought these nice, I believe these come from CVS, maybe. Uh, licorice. And I like these, but not as well as I like just straight licorice. But I was hankering for some, and that was all I could find. This is Tresemme um, Botan Botanic Color Vibrance and Shine intensive mask. Um, I used this. It made my hair softer. Um, my hair has gotten so coarse and it's dry that I need moisturizing stuff. Alright. These are the Ultra Shine um, dishwasher tablets. I think these work fine. I have no problems with them. I highly recommend them from the Dollar Tree. And this I got at the Dollar Tree. These were the um, Brothers All Natural Banana Fruit Crisps. I really like these better than that other brand. These tasted just like eating bananas. I mean, it was really, really good. These are some cleansing wipes, citrus orange scented. Uh, these are from the Dollar Tree, and they are so-so. I It's hard to beat Bolero, really. I mean, if you're shopping at the Dollar Tree. Um, these I really like. These are the soft and gentle lavender scented feminine cl cleansing cloths. I use them for all kinds of stuff. Um, my feet get very dirty out at the camper, so I wipe my feet with them at night before I go to bed and stuff because I might have just took a shower and I but my feet get dirty because it's, it's so dusty out there. We need to get paved roads. Alrighty, this I got at the Dollar Tree and I got it because Tracy B always eats it and this was the party mix and it was the nacho flavored tortilla chips and corn chips and fried cheese curls and pretzels. And Ron and I were playing, um, what were we playing? Cards one night. Some kind of cards. And we ate the whole bag. It was a great little snack. Uh, these are the Snuggle Exhilaration uh, Lavender Vanilla Dryer Sheets. Love these things. They smell really good. And I never did find the really nice smelling ones at the Dollar Tree. I haven't found them. Uh, here's some Ricola Herbal Immunity. I did try them. These came from uh, I can't remember what you call it. But anyway, um, it, it was a gummy. It was okay, but I'm not, I don't, I'm not in the habit of taking stuff like that, but if I was had to, I would buy them. Here's another uh, mainstay, mold cider wax cubes. Mmm. Smells exactly like apple cider. Mold apple cider it is good. So I would say that mainstays and home and garden are both good. It's got to, you know, get the right pick. Boys and girls, we're down to the last three. Um, this is honey, wild honeysuckle. These were, they smell exactly like honeysuckle, but they were so strong. They would almost knock you out. This was a sample of Sensodyne toothpaste I also got. And, uh, it works really well. Deep clean. I took it on my mission trip. Ron and I were deep cleaning our teeth with it. And last but not least... I bought these, but I doubt that I'll, well, I might buy them again. They're the Snuggle Scent Boosters, and they're like pods. 
I'd rather just grab the ones from the Dollar Tree, the crystals. I think they're just fine. Although, I did notice when I bought them the other day, the containers are now smaller. So anyway, that is my garbage for about two months or three months. I don't know. Four months. And uh, I hope you have some good garbage at your house. I hope some of these reviews were helpful to either buy or not buy something. And I hope you're having a great day. I love you a long time. And always stay crafty. Bye-bye now.